Everybody, today you're going to want one heavy dumbbell, and that's going to be for so basically a heavy for lower body and a heavy for upper body. And then you need a pair of dumbbells for some chest flies and then a mat or a soft surface. I'm going to go ahead and start going over our moves. Our first one, just your typical butt kicks, bringing those heels up to the glutes slightly forward. Second one, goblet squat, using that one heavy for your lower legs, holding by the bell, step out wide, drop it low into that squat. And then we have like Romanian deadlift with one dumbbell. So we're gonna hold it horizontally. Feet right about shoulder width, slight bend, push those hips back, nice flat back. And then power up, slight thrust forward to kind of reset that body. And then we have a behind the back trap raise. So you're gonna hold that, that dumbbell horizontally still behind our back, slight bend, push those hips back a little bit. And you're just basically doing a front raise, but we're just doing it behind the back. So we can get those triceps and then our upper traps to those back muscles. And then we're gonna do a static lunge push off. So basically staying on that one side of the body, out into a lunge, push off, and then stay on that side, go back, pushing off with that leg that you stepped out with, and then halfway through we'll switch over to the other side. And then we'll take it down to the ground for a V-sit chest fly or a C-sit, depending on your intensity level. So C-sit, heels down, toes are up, leaning it back, slide bend the elbow as you open and close the chest. Otherwise, you've got your V-sit option where you bring those legs completely up off the ground. And then we're going to do a glute bridge raise to a skull crusher. So you need that heavy again. Feet flat on the ground, arms are up. When you push up into that glute bridge raise, skull crusher and then lower down. So squeeze the glutes, bringing that dumbbell right to the forehead, and then lowering right back down. And then our next one after that is a plank to a dolphin. So you're gonna be in a low plank with those forearms, and then you push off into that dolphin, and then we're right back down. So that's gonna be kind of at your own pace, doing whatever works for you. Basically a down dog on those forearms. And then we are going to come up, we've got a sumo squat, kind of an overhead bend, so bringing that elbow to the knee. Stepping out wide, fingertips by the face, you squat, and then oblique side bend. And we'll alternate sides for us, make sure you're crunching on those obliques. And then we're going to take it back down for a single leg lift crunch, and we'll alternate that. So lying back, your right leg straight up in the air, crunch, lower that leg down, bring your left up, and crunch. Those are our 10 moves. We're gonna go ahead and get started with butt kicks. Three rounds, 60 seconds each with that one minute break in between. Here we go, starting our timer. Three, two, one, butt kick, go. Get that body nice and warmed up. Again, just slightly forward. And you're getting those heels all the way up to the glute. If you need to modify this, Kind of a step, a little hop with it. Halfway. Fifteen seconds left. Keep that pace. Get those heels up. It's not just a little jog in place. Get them up there. Three, two, one. Next up, goblet squat. We have fifteen seconds in between each exercise to get ourselves ready. Take your time. Step it out wide. Toes pointed forward. Dumbbells up and down. Three, two, one, begin. Sit back on those heels. Push those hips back. Drive up through those heels. When you go to stand up, try to tell yourself it's just your heels, not your toes. As low as you can go. Left 
less than 10 seconds left. And then if this is your dumbbell you're using for our Romanian deadlift, keep that in your hands. Three, two, one. Good, step it in. Turn that dumbbell over. We're gonna work the other side of our legs now, work on those hamstrings, those glutes. Slight bend in the knees, flat back in three, two, one. Here we go. Push those hips back, take your time. Do not rush this one. Keep that fight forward, those shoulders back. As soon as you feel that pull in those hamstrings, power yourself up, slight thrust forward. Halfway. Job, don't look down at the ground. Three, two, one. Good. You're going to need your heavy for your upper body. We've got those behind the back trap raises. We'll hold that dumbbell behind us. A bell in each hand. Slight hinge forward. Three, two, one. Don't expect to go up too high, unless you've got those weird shoulder joints like circus people do. Bend those shoulder blades together. You can even hold it out there for a little bit and then bring it back. In the upper back, those trap muscles, a little bit in the triceps. If you need to slightly bend those knees for stability, go for it. Otherwise, there's a slight lean forward so we can really extend our range behind us. Last five, three, two, one. Good. We've got that static lunge push off. No weight, so you can get super low and then power off of that leg you stepped out with. And then stay on that side. We'll switch halfway. Three, two, one. Here we go. Super low and then power off. Nice balance. Pull that core in. Get ready to switch. Three, two, one. Other side. Job, get low. Feel that inner thigh work of the other leg, the quad of the other. Three, two, one. Good. All right. V sit, chest fly. Next up after this is our glute bridge one. So have that one dumbbell next to you. Three, two, one. Lean it back. The dumbbells are in front of you. Slight bend, open and close. Whenever you need a break, set them down. Bring yourself up and then lower back down. Breathe through this. Don't hold your breath. You can keep that bend in your elbows the entire time. Even when you bring those weights center, you don't always have to go up here.
10 seconds left. Three, two, one, good. All right, grab that one dumbbell. Raise up in the glute bridge. Perform that skull crusher, arms are straight, and then lower the glutes down. Three, two, one, begin. Power up with those heels. Get those hips up, squeeze the glutes. And then and only then can you do that skull crusher. Keep those arms tucked in tight. Elbows pointed to those knees. Ten seconds left. Three, two, one. Good. Safely lower that weight down. Flip it on over. We've got our low plank to dolphin. Stay on those forearms the whole time. Go at your own pace. Hold it for as long as you want to. Three, two, one. Begin. Hold that low plank. And then when you're ready, your hands kind of come together. And you push those booties back. Get those hips up. If you need to readjust your arms every single time, not a problem. But when you're in that plank, your hands are not touching. Dolphin's the only time those hands can come together. So we can get that nice arch in our back. Well over halfway. Really press those forearms into the ground on dolphin. Get that nice shoulder work. Last three, two, one. We got, all right, bring it up. We've got our sumo squat with our oblique bends. So just raise that knee up, crunch, move the elbow to the knee. Top obliques and bottom obliques. Got to work them all. Meet in the middle. Step it out wide. Three, two, one. Begin. A squat in between each side. Get low, we've got no weights. Work on that booty while we're working on those obliques. Three, two, one. Single leg lift crunch. So again, Left leg out, right leg up, crunch, lower, and switch. Three, two, one, begin. If you need to modify with me, go for it. Otherwise, that leg that's down, that can be touching the ground. That leg, your heel. Unless you want to add some intensity and keep it hovered, you don't have to. Alternate those legs. One crunch with the right leg up, switch the legs. Give me another crunch. You're already well over halfway. Almost time for our first break. Up. 
Last five, three, two, one. Good job. All right, one minute break and then we'll go for round two. Here we go, three, two, one, bring them up. Get that heart rate back up after a break. Remember, we're really trying to get those heels up to the glutes. It's not just a little jog in place. Get them up there. Slightly forward, pump those arms, make it go faster. Fifteen seconds left. Keep that pace. Let's go. We'll slow everything down with our strength moves. This is the one I need you to go fast on. Last three, two, one. Goblet squats. Three, two. One, here we go. Get low. Don't let this weight in the front take you forward. Push that butt back. So back on those heels. Last round, remember I said power up through those heels. When you're going to stand up, you should be able to wiggle your toes. All the way in those heels. That's how we work the glutes, our quads. Last 10. Three, two, one. If you're using that same dumbbell, flip it over. We'll get ready for those Romanian deadlifts, our straight leg deadlift. You put up a slight bend for stability, and that's it. Three, two, one. Here we go. Keep that side up at me. Shoulders back. Take it super slow. Make it up in stages if you need to. Slightly bend. Push, 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 push. Hold. Then reverse. Slight thrust forward. The slower, more in control you go, the more your hamstrings are going to feel it, the stronger they're going to get. Less than 15 seconds left. Three, two, one. Good. All right, we got that behind the back trap raise, whatever way you're using for your heavy upper body. When I say slightly forward, this is all I mean. Nothing too crazy, not flat back or anything like that. Three, two, one, here we go. 
Nice subtle raises back there. Keep those arms tucked in nice and tight. So don't bow out those elbows. Arms are straight. So we're feeling this in that upper back, around the neck, back of the shoulders, the triceps, those small muscles that we tend to forget about. That's what we're getting with these. Ten seconds left. And we've got our lunge push offs. Three, two, one. Very good. Weights down. Whatever side you want to start with, we'll switch halfway. Power up with that leg you step out with. Get low, low, low. Three, two, one. Begin. Don't let that foot touch the ground. Get your body back center, but balance on one leg. Still at that angle. Three, two, one, other side. How low can you get? Sit back on that heel. Pull those shoulders back. Look up. Don't look down. Three, two, one. Take it down. V or C sit chest fly. Three, two, one. Lean it back, activate that core. Slide bend in those arms. Remember, you don't need to send your arms out. There's still a slight bend. Don't open up that chest with straight arms. We don't want to pull anything. You've got that option too, if you want a little higher intensity, get those feet up off the ground. That makes it tough because your body wants to fall back, wants to roll back. So you gotta even pull that core in tighter than we're doing when our heels are down. Stabilize yourself. 10 seconds left. Three, two, one, way to push through. Grab your dumbbell for your skull crushers. We've got our glute bridge. Three, two, one, begin. Squeeze those glutes every single time. Don't just raise your hips up. Higher intensity, you can bring your feet closer together. You can get your toes up off the ground. A lot of different options. Twenty seconds left. Three, two, one. Good. See if you set that dumbbell down. Let's flip ourselves over. Plank to dolphin. Three, two, one. Here we go. 
Again, you're holding these for as long as you want to. But when you transition back into that plank, those hips are down, we got a nice flat back. Should be able to eat my bowl of Cheerios off your back and you're not gonna spill any of it. Gotta really push, force those forearms into the ground on dolphin. Less than 15 seconds left. Three, two, one. Good job, bring it up. Sumo squat, oblique bend, knee to elbow, step it out wide, hands up, three, two, one, here we go. Remember, we're not just raising that knee, we're meeting it with the elbow, crunching from the top and from the bottom. Fifteen seconds left. Three, two, one. Take it down. Single leg lift crunch. Alternate that raised leg or modify with me. Three, two. One, begin. Get through this, we get our break. And then our third and final round coming up. Halfway. Last ten. Three. Two, one, good job, take a break. Three, two, one, here we go. Last 10 minutes of work right here. Good job, last time you're gonna do this, pick up that pace, let's go. Halfway. Three, 
Come on, push through, last 10 seconds. My favorite song just came on, I picked up my pace, let's go. Three, two, one, good job. Goblet squats, grab your dumbbell. Step it out wide, toes forward. Three, two, one, drop it low. Halfway. Last three. Two, one, RDL. Be a little wider than shoulder width, not much. Let's work those hamstrings. Here we go. Three, two, one, begin. Those of you wondering, the song that came on, you should all listen to it. It's Could Have Been Me by The Struts. It's about not wasting a day or your time on shit you don't care about. And making sure you're not looking back on stuff and saying, that could have been me. It's a good song. Jog, keep pushing that butt back. We got three seconds left. Two. One, behind the back traps. I'm going five, three, two, one. Here we go, trap raises. Don't forget that slight lean forward. Nothing too crazy. Just adds a little bit more range for us for those raises. Halfway. Less than 10 seconds left. We got those static lunge push offs. Three, two, one. Very good. Weights down. All in that heel. Get nice and low. Feel the inner thigh of the other leg working too. Three, two, one. Begin. Almost time to switch. Here we go, last one on this side. And switch.
Last one. Three, two, one. Good. Take it down to the ground. Chest fly. Here we go. Three, two, one. Begin. Keep that bend in those arms. Keep that lean back too. Don't slowly come all the way up here. We're back here. Last 15. Three, two, one. Good job. Blue break, full pressure. Three, two, one. Begin. My goodness, little nugget does not like when I do these fluttering all around. Well over halfway, you guys, good job. Here we go, last one, three, two, one. Lower that weight down. Got our plank to dolphin. So close to being done with class. Three more moves. Here we go. Three, two, one. Begin. Halfway, keep going at your own pace. Really targeting those shoulders and that core with this one. Push the ground away in that dolphin. Last three, two, one, very good. Bring it on up. Squat and side bend. Step it out a little wider than shoulder width. Bring those arms up. Ready? And begin. Last 10, then back down to the ground for our last one, and we are done for the day. 
Three, two, one, take it down. Get yourself set up, single leg lift crunches, alternate that leg. Three, two, one, begin. Halfway. Last five. Three, two, one. Lay on back all the way, full body stretch. And thank you so much for joining me today.